All right, how you doing today? Today we're taking a look at a hidden feature that is in Logic Pro 11. It's actually in Logic Pro 10 as well, but the drum kit designer here, this is how to create snare rolls, cymbal rolls, and flams and other stuff like that on your drums. And by the way, please do subscribe to the channel. I have hundreds of other videos in my back catalog, music production stuff, lot of logic stuff as well. But anyways, let's get into this. So here's the trick. Why it's not by default, I don't know. Maybe it takes up more sampling, CPU or something. But if you go into the, the MIDI effects here and you go to logic and you go to descriptor, we can go down to these presets, app presets, and then we have drum kit, designer, embellishments. And we just click that on, and then we have all these extra things here, this uh, snare flam. Little buzz rolls. Symbol, crescendo. And just those extra things here. And we can move this to a different octave. The only one that I found to be overlapping, if I turn this off, I guess that's the maraca or something. When I turn it on, it's a buzz rule. But everything else is off in that octave. I don't know why that one overlaps, that's kind of strange. But you can do a tom roll here as well. The tom rolls are off by default, but you can do those as well. So that's pretty cool. Anyways, just a quick trip, trick, <laughs> just a quick tip today. Um, yeah, so check it out. Let me know what you think. That is all for now, and I will talk to you soon.